please read the disclaimer. Welcome. I'm Bio, and today we're playing... Oh! How dare you shoot at me! Do 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 James Bond 007 Nightfire for the Game Boy Advance. There we go. That's what we're playing today. Nightfire. Probably one of the James Bond games most people know. Like this is one of my f the PlayStation 2 version of this game is one of my friends' favorite games of all time for the PlayStation 2. Nightfire. But we're having a look at the Game Boy Advance version. I wonder what this one's going to be like. It's going to be interesting. I did play a little bit of Nightfire around my friend's house. I didn't own it personally uh, back in the day, but I like the music. They got the theme on here pretty well for the Game Boy Advance. So <coughs> let's just do normal. Oh, see, there must be a uh, must be a. St <laughs> All right. Buy or. Done. All right then. So mission one, Austrian castle. Oh yeah, the very first mission of Nightfire. Probably one of the only missions I've played for the game. I think I played like the first three missions of Nightfire on my around my friend's house back when I was a kid. So uh, I'm supposed to be reading this. So Nato has survived. That recovery is critical. Should be an unfriendly powers reserve. Engineer this device. The platform's global defense capabilities would be severely compromised. Oh no, that's not good. Recent intelligence implicates Raphael Drake in the theft. Hard to believe, as Drake is a respected green industrialist whose Phoenix, oh no, international, oh okay, it dismantles obsolete atomic reactors and decommissions nuclear arsenals. I heard Phoenix and I got worried. An allied, allied agent planted in Drake's organization reports that Alexander Mayhow is not giving me enough time to read this. I don't care. I don't. I don't care. You're not giving me enough time to read it. Oh my word! What is this? Oh my. There's a guy down there. Okay, this reminds me of Doom. <laughs> Tell you what it is. This just reminds me of Doom. This is interesting. I see some guards and that. All right, so L1, L1, or L and R sh shapes me between. Oh, is it a shot? So that shoots up and down. Oh, so up jumps, down is crouch. Issues here. How do I move the reticle up and down? I guess you jump here, yeah, crouch and jump. Right, we want to be crouching. Da, 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 da. What's this way? There was a guard here. Oh, this came from a door. This is pixelated. The fuck does not look good, does it? Let's see if we can get this guy. Alright, managed to kill him. Douche! I picked up the douche M9K. Nice. I lost some health there, but whatever. Maybe I was harder to hit. Okay. Ah. That, so that reloads. What changes my weapon? I picked up a new weapon. How do I use it? Oh, yeah. Show me the controls, please. Clearly, this is something that's required. All right. Move and turn. Aim, use scope on land. L and R plus. Okay, so I have to hold L and R both down in order to move around. Thrust underwater space. Duck on land. Weapon changes B plus. Oh, this control scheme is fucking horrible. Oh, 
that's terrible. That's terrible. So we got an Uzi. Imagine if they remade this game, and it played like this, like it, like a do. It kind of reminds me of a Doom game, if I'll be honest. Is anybody in here? Hello? Oh. Got him. So select is like reload, okay? Let's go collect the weapons. Give us more ammo for this thing. Alright, so do I go through here? No. Inter it's very interesting kind of idea, so they've decided like, I know there is Doom on, oh god, there is Doom on the, yeah this is a aim. At least I can just shoot them anywhere, really, and it kills them. But this control scheme does not work on the Game Boy Advance. In the slightest. It's it's just not good. I'm going to be honest with you. It's just not good. I love the concept. This is brilliant. I mean, like, imagine Nightfire, but it's like Doom. That's a cool concept. Don't get me wrong. Oh, got some armor. Oh, nice. Got some health back. Yeah, you know what I mean? It's like... That's really cool that you've made the game like this. It's just too bad. It's just. It's just too bad. It kind of sucks. Nice try. Got ya. Now I have all the ammo. Yeah, I'm just gonna crouch here so I can pick up the ammo without falling off the edge. I feel like that's something. I think that's a spotlight, but I'm, I'm up here, so it's not an issue. Anyone there? Thing is, you press L1 to kind of strafe that way. At least then you can kind of shoot to kill. Shoot to kill. But like I said, I like the concept of this, but the controls I don't think fit. You know, that's just my two cents on it. I don't like the controls. Anyone down there or not? I don't know. Maybe I'm I don't know. I think I'm supposed to go down there. I don't know. It's been a long time since I played Nightfire in any degree. I don't know if this game copies what you're supposed to do. Anyone else up here? Anyone else? Oh, that was the only person. Oh, found an armor vest. Oh, that fu fully healed me. Nice. Oh, it's... You're dead. Yeah, you're dead. 69! <laughs> Sorry. Do, 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 Anything here? No. Nope. Supposed to go down here? Oh, there's a stairway there. Am I supposed to, is there stairs here? Or not? Hmm. Uh, I think pass is the answer to that. Do I go down there? What if I fall down here? No, no, no damage. Fine. Nice. No, da no damage, full damage. Well, I don't think there should be in a game like this, full damage. You could easily just walk off the edge accidentally. 
He got bad, more bad guys in here? No, I think I've taken them all out. I don't think I could shot him up there, maybe. Maybe I'm supposed to go through this door. But I, I, I just think this so cool. Yeah, I'm supposed to go through here. We confirm that Agent Nightshade uh, and the deep cover operative will be Ronda while we're in the castle library. Okay. I trust you'll maintain a low profile, 007. Well, I, I've maintained a low profile up until now, you know. I at least, at least I like to think so. I remember in the original Nightfire, yeah, there's a lot of stealth involved, which is fair enough. But it's very difficult to kind of pull that off in this type of game. But I think um, I think that will do for James Bond 007 Nightfire. I, I like to think that I've seen what the game kind of has to offer there. So kind of cool. I'd be very interested in seeing like a Doom James Bond game. So... Anyway, I've been Bio, I hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.